make sure I've got audio. Have I got audio? Yes, I have got audio. Welcome, guys. Welcome, welcome. Apologies for the audio. Check at the beginning there. Just needed to check. But today, guys, we're doing another train sim world to Creators Club scenario. But yeah, before we get started, if you enjoy this sort of content, guys, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to hit the notification bell so you get notified when my videos and streams go live. Also, feel free to hit the like button if you enjoy what you see, and feel free to hit the share button as well. So. Yeah, and I'll put my links to my Twitch and my Discord down below as well. But today, guys, we're having a look at another Tom Fresco DLC. DLC, sorry, scenario called the Heathrow Air Express replacement with the class 314. That is, yes, it's the 313 in the, in the pictures, but it's actually based on the 314 from the Cathcart Circle. So the description says, Hello, new stock is being rolled out to Heathrow Express services. But there has been a few technical flaws, so in order to keep the trains running, older trains are used as replacement. Take this six car, first capital connect at 314 from London Paddington to Hazen Harlington, calling it all stations. So, yeah. This is on the Great Western Express. This is based on, based on, sorry, this route is on. So if you want to play it, you need the Great Western Express, which is 24.99 on the Xbox Store, PlayStation Store, Steam Store, and Epic Store. You'll also need the Kafka Circle to get access to the 314, which is available on the Xbox Store, PlayStation Store, Steam Store and Epic Store as well. So, let's go to Tools, Scenario Planner, and let's have a look. Heathrow Replacements. So, what's required? So, you need the Class 314 from Cathcart Circle, the, well, the HST comes from GWE, the 166 comes from GWE, the, 60, the other HST from GWE, the class 66 from GWE, the class 387 slash 2 from London Commuter, and the class 66 from this DLC as well. So it says here, drive the SCR class 314 six car loaded from London Pennington platform 7 to Hazen Harlington platform 5, making five passenger stops along the way. This scenario is off the rails. So, let's go and have a look. But yeah, as I say, guys, you require the Great Western Express and the Cathcart Circle for this. So yeah, another scenario, another Creators Club scenario. Very interesting. And yeah, as I say, guys, the class of three one fours are no longer in service now either. They have been removed from service. Quite a while ago, actually. Can't remember when. But okay, let's see if I can find any information on the class three one four. And also, before I get way too uh, indulged in the stream or video, whatever this will turn out to be, let's see what's going on with train sim this week from DTG's uh, point of view. Like with streams and everything. So, announcements. So, the Rail Fan TV schedule for this week, week beginning the 7th of March 2022. So, tomorrow guys, Tuesday the 8th of March, there is a Train Simulator 2 roadmap stream with Nat and Matt. Wednesday the 9th of March, Union Pacific F3 Train Simulator 2022 with Jamie. And Thursday the 10th of March, Harlem Line Preview, look guys, for Train Simulator 2 with Matt and JT. It's a preview stream guys, it doesn't mean it's coming out this Thursday. Just 
to make it clear. And streams start at 8 o'clock in the evening UTC on Twitch and YouTube. There we go, guys. So, he's for Express, the scenario is called. And yeah, like I said, guys, this is made by Tom Fresco. If you're watching this, Tom Fresco, hello, by the way. So, as you can see here, we're at London Paddington. So yeah, we've got the blue HST over there, another blue HST, a 166, green HST. Sorry for any FPS loss here guys, just taking a screenshot. There we go. And another one. Right, when they go to 166. And the other thing is, guys, uh, Tom Fresco, if you're watching this on YouTube, why is the 314s in Scott Rail livery? Because in the picture you put up, uh, it says the class 313s are in. Uh, what's it called? Yeah, 1st Cab Sucking Link, the 313. Uh, I might have, um, have something wrong somewhere. Or a uh, first great western, first great western, first cup token net delivery might need downloading. If you can point me out in the comments down below where to find it, I will be really happy. So, uh, thank you. I was going to say, I have unlocked the doors. So, yeah, we are calling out. So the scenario is called Heathrow Express, we are calling at Acton Mainline, Ealing Broadway, West Ealing, Hanwell, South Hall, and Hayes and Harlington. This scenario. And the GSM is not working in this version, oh, well in the 314. For now we'll just put the DRA on because uh, we're not moving anywhere. And we'll have the window open. Lovely. Take the DRA off. Right, train brake is released. And let's go. First station stop, Acton Main Line in 3.9 miles. Yeah, like I say guys, I have got plenty of Creators Club content on from me on Creators Club. Uh, I've looked at quite a few Creators Club scenarios. I've looked at the FGW HST, I've looked at the FGW 166. I've looked at the 666, wow, 33s. I've also looked at the 313 scenarios. So yeah, as I say, if you've got this far on the YouTube guys and you want me to have a look at some creator scenario, creator club scenarios you've made, put them down in the description down below and I'll have a look at them. Description, sorry, comments down below. And I'll have a look at them. So, information on the class at 314. Waiting for the uh, wiki to load up. There we go. So these were in service, guys, between 1979 and 2019. They were made by British Rail Rail Engineering Limited B R E L. Family nine. Family nine. Wow. Family name B R E L. 1972. Constructed in 1979. These units were refurbished between 2006 and 2007, 2009 and 2010, and 2011 and 2013. There was only 16 of them built. 
15 have been scrapped, one has been saved because for um, hydrogen, uh, yeah, hydrogen tests. The successor of these are class 385. So these were numbered 314201 to 314216, capacity 212 seats. So the operators of these 314s were British Rail, Scott Rail, British Rail version, Scott Rail National Express, First Scott Rail and Abellio Scott Rail. The depots were Glasgow Shields Road and Glasgow Highland. The lines they served were the Argyle Line, North Clyde Line, the Cathcart Circle, the Inverclyde Line and the Parsley Canal Line. Maximum speed of these units is 70 miles an hour, which is 113 kilometers an hour. So the power they put out is 308, no, sorry, 600, sorry, 880 horsepower, which is 660 kilowatts. The electric system is 25 k, uh, k volts, which is the overhead system. And current. Yeah, uh, the cur current collector is a pantograph, and uh, yeah, that's about all the information I can give you on the class three one four. So yeah, I will link that down below, guys, so you can read that information yourself. Right, we're 1.4 miles away from Picton Mainline. And there is Old Oak Common over there, guys. Right, as we're going past. That is no longer there anymore. That has been replaced by a high that's been replaced by a high speed two station called Old Old Oak Common. And also a crossrail station as well called Old Old Oak Common as well. I'll just let you know that. I say there's plenty of traffic on this route, plenty. I've like seen one, two, three, f about four or five HSTs already. Well, probably about more than that. I've seen 166s, uh, I'm driving the 314. I've seen two 314s already. I haven't seen the 387 unit yet. But we are coming up to Acton Mainline. And another 314. But that one's just arrived because I just had his doors open. Nice stomp, aren't she? So yeah, there's the second unit right behind it. There goes the 166 units. They were a bit of a surprise, actually. Yeah, there's the uh, 314 interior. It looks quite similar to the uh, 313 interior. If you've ever driven the 313. If you haven't driven the 313, guys, that's another interesting train to train unit to drive. Oh, 
Right, our next station stop in 1.4 miles is Eden Broadway. And there goes an express 314. Just sitting on the side of the unit. Sixty six in DP Shank delivery. Hello, Keith, how are you? Welcome to the stream, welcome to the stream video, whatever this is going to turn out to be. Welcome. Ealing Broadway in 0 0.7 miles. So yeah, if you want to know the route we're on, guys, we're on the Great Western Express between Paddington and Reading. Is this one of the downloadable scenarios? Yes it is. It is called Heathrow Express Replacement on the Creators Club. I say you need the Great Western Express and you need Cathcart Circle. And obviously you need Train Simwell too, obviously. Into emergency break. Well done, me. And there goes the sixty-six. One, two, three, four, four sixty-sixes. Nice. Right, Elian Broadway. Oh, that's good. If you have both, you'll be able to play this scenario. So this uh, scenario runs from Paddington to Hayes and Harlington. Platform 5. Yep. Just to let you know, Keith, on Creators Club I do have... Uh, my content as well if you want to have a look at it I do have quite a few scenarios on there I have quite a few liveries so feel free to have a look at them right West Ealing next So have you played this scenario before then, Keith, or... Because um, it shows in the pictures of this scenario that there is a first Capital Connect 313 to run this scenario. But I've tried looking for the livery for the 313 and it just gives me... Oh, there's the 387. There we go. You need London Commuter for that. Yes, so um, as I was saying, yeah, it shows the first cab talking about 313 livery in the pictures, but when I log into the scenario, it gives me the 314 in Scott Rail livery, which I don't understand. Here we've got a red light at West Ealing. I 
I follow in a train by any chance? Oh, okay. So you're doing your Clinchfield run this evening. Nice. Is your Clinchfield scenarios available to uh, play on Creators Club by any chance, Keith? Because I might have a look at them. Because I am always looking for new scenarios to uh, stream and have a look at. put up onto YouTube. Yeah, so I don't know how to get the first Cub to connect 313 delivery for this, because I know the Scott Rail livery isn't correct, so yeah, I'm a bit confused. Oh, 314 coming in. Strangely without a pantograph up. Okay. <laughs> confused. Hang on. Bear with me. That's not right. I know what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to get the flyby camera. Shut the doors. This is probably not the right camera that I'm using. I thought not. We'll do a flyby at uh, Hanwell. I have the 313 add-on as well, which is uh, funny. I have the 313 add-on installed. But the 313 on this route... Sorry, the 313 in this game doesn't have the pantograph on it. So, confused. Yeah, interesting. Yeah, so hey Keith, is there any uh, scenarios you want me to have a look at? Let me know and I'll actually uh, have a look at them on a video or stream for you. I say I have got a list of a lot of scenarios to look at already as well. Right, here we come to Hanwell. Unlock the doors. Can we unlock the doors, please? Okay, it's strangely, I can't unlock the doors that way. Yeah, as I say, if you look on my YouTube channel, uh, Keith, there's quite a lot of um, scenarios of people that I have actually looked at. I say I've looked at through 33 years, I've looked at the First Great Western HST, the First Great Western 166, the Southern 313, uh, now the Scott Rail 314. You've only got London to Brighton route. Oh, okay. 
Oh, yeah, I know. When you've got loads and loads and loads of roots, you're trying to fit everything in and it's not easy. <laughs> well, like I say, Keith, uh, on my YouTube channel, I've got over... Well, this is probably going to blow you away. I've got over 160 Train Sim World 2 videos and I look at every single route that I actually uh, own. Right, next station stop, guys, is South Hall. So, yeah, on this scenario, what we've got left is South Hall and Hayes and Harlington. And then I think we will end this, well, we will end it when we get to Hayes and Harlington and look to all the other stuff. But, guys, I will be back with another video or stream whatever it turns out to be looking at another scenario with another route and I've already got one in mind it's called the class 313 boat train Well, put it this way, Keith, if you ever want a hand with how to run a train or a locomotive, a train, a unit, a locomotive, I can try my best to try and help you. I'd say I'm very well known for helping people. <laughs> you off to Keith? Just curious. Okay, another one six six. Okay, we're coming into South Hall. Oh, you're sat on the sofa with your feet up. Nice. Well, as you've probably kind of noticed, um, Keith, via my YouTube channel, you've probably noticed I play a lot of games. I'm quite a variety person. <laughs> right, we've arrived at uh, South Hall. So we've got one more station stop after this, which will be Hayes and Harlington. You know what, while we're here, we'll have a look through the 314. Oh yeah, my doors are... Uh, okay, I didn't realise the seat did that. Okay, and there's a 387 just coming in, in the window. So if you've never seen the 314, here is the 314. Looks very identical to the 313. I don't know why that was a bit laggy. Is it set on your 
So yeah, here's the other unit. Well, this is the back of one unit and the other unit's back there. Uh, did, did, what am I doing? Close the door. Thank you. The door I actually wanted to close was this one here. Right. As I say, I do um, stream Farm Sim 22 sometimes. Uh, I just haven't streamed it for quite a while now. Elite Dangerous, never played it. And uh, Minecraft. Yeah, I've played Minecraft but never streamed Minecraft, so interesting. Right, we have arrived. Right, we are now off to Of penultimate stop of Hayes and Hollington. Which is in one point six miles. Oh, okay. Yeah, I have quite a few multiplayer farms going on on farms in. Another EWS 66. Nice. Yeah, you have subbed to my YouTube, because uh, I got a notification through about it the other day. Thank you very much for that, Keith. And just for your kind, generous support... Well, actually coast, because I've got 50. Yes, we're saying for your... Oh, 66. Oh, shush. Oh, great. I've put the emergency brakes on. Yes, what I was saying, for your kind generosity, Keith, I will follow you on the Twitch as well. There we go, you've got a follow from me as well. Right, now I've got to try to say how to get out of the emergency break on the 314. Right, how do I get out of an emergency break on the 3 There we go. 
what you need to do guys is keep your break up in emergency turn your master key off well turn your air reverser off turn it back on and there we go you're out of emergency break What do you mean you're not up to my standards, sir, Keith? I say everybody has their own standards of uh, streaming and everything. I say I even have my own standards. Sixty six just there. Right, we are coming into platform five at Hayes and Harlington. I know it says to stop at the top of the platform guys, but I am not stopping at the top of the platform. I am actually going into the platform. Don't know why it always wants everybody to stop at the top of the platform for that is really irritating. Ah, uh, buffer. Don't clunk the buffer. Uh, okay, I'm kissing the buffer. Ah, <laughs> uh, dear me. What am I gonna do? Right, there we go. I have reached the uh, Hayes and Harlington. For some reason, it's not registering as me uh, doing the door thing. It's weird. Could it be... what are you doing? Could it be because I'm kissing the uh, buffers because that'd be what it is. It shouldn't be that. I have unlocked the doors, thank you very much. Why are you not registering it? I don't know. I don't know what is going on with my uh, doors here. Oh, what's turning up? What's turning up? Oh, it's... it's uh, one six six. Well, okay. I don't know what's going on with the doors. Yeah, TS is fun. TSW is fun. Well, I'm gonna have. Go on, one six six. Sod off. Just waiting for the 166 to sod off guys and then I will uh, continue what I was about to say. Thank you. <sighs> yeah, like I say guys, I'm going to leave it there for this one. Because I can't open the doors. So, well, let's go back to main menu. I say, very interesting scenario. Um, here for Express. 
but we'll go back to the main menu we'll have a look in creators club and i'll show you guys where you can find this scenario okay i've got an achievement and yes if you want to know guys i'm playing on xbox if people wanted to know <laughs> i just got an achievement for driving uh the 314 70 miles so let's go back come on thank you so creators club let's say i have done a video on creators club as well so head over to my youtube and have a look at that so the subscriptions here it is it is called tf Heathrow express replacement is what it's called by tom fresco so yeah the description is new rolling new stock is being rolled out on the Heathrow Express services but it's but it has a few technical flaws so in order to keep the trains running older trains are being used as a replacement take this six car first cab to connect 314 from London Paddington to Hazen Harlington as you can see there guys it's got the first capital connect livery in the pictures when I ran the scenario just now it came up with the Scott Rail pictures so if you know why that's happening guys put it down in the comments and down below well if you ever want help with streaming Keith just give me a shout but yeah as I say I'm gonna leave it there I say I'll put my links to Twitch Discord uh, let me think Twitch Discord Train Simulator 2, Great Western Express, Cathcart Circle, all down below for you guys to have a look at. But yeah, as I say, if you're watching this on the Twitch, guys, I will be back shortly with another scenario video, whatever you call it. But yeah, stay safe, guys. Have a nice rest of the day, and I'll catch you in the next one.